It's a Friday on a Sunday. Sure, everything's hooked up there. Been a while. The last time up. was on May, May 30th, so June I didn't get up at all. So it's a windy, kind of a windy morning, but it's pretty much down the runway. But uh, this time of the year it's hard to get decent flying weather. It's been just blowing and hot, hot, hot. We just finished, uh, just come out of a heat wave. So, the canola fields are all bloomed, they're quite beautiful, so I figure I'll get up and, and, uh, geez, I gotta catch up on my logbook. Gotta get up and, uh, get some flying done, get some video. I have no idea why I brought this tube of grease with me. <laughs> um, real airplane grease. Yeah. Supposed to put it on the table. For some reason, I threw it in here. Oh, I know why. Because I was supposed to put a bottle of water in here, and I put the grease in instead. Jeez, uh, getting old is uh, <laughs> something else. <laughs> yeah. West Block traffic. Old West Block of Tango up here. Six miles to the west. Inbound. 3,200 feet. I'll be on a long downwind for two eight. West Block. That's Larry. One of the three or four Larrys. West Hawk traffic, ultralight India, Sierra Charlie Hotel, rolling on 2 8. West Hawk traffic. Oh, yeah, she's squirrely, man. It's squirrely, with a bit of a crosswind to boot. Oh yeah, look at those canola fields. Oh yeah, we got lots of fun wind. Plus our traffic ultra late in the uh, Sierra Charlie Hotel heading northwest out of the circuit. I have uh, another ultra late in sight there. Copy that. Ultra late Fox are tango off this area joining that right down there for two eight. We're touching go on the grass. Yeah, the air's a little squirrely on the ground there. <laughs> okay, good. That was Lachlan on there. A little bit like that all the way up there. Yeah, she's a little bouncy for so early in the morning. They're pretty low ceiling too. So, but uh, again, I just want to get up and have a peek at the all the uh, canola fields before they turn green. Thing I'll let me.
Yeah, it's getting a little calmer now. I'm almost, almost at 900 feet up. Now 1,000 feet AGL. It's 32.50 ASL. Everybody get their first cut of hay going. I don't know about a second cut. Hopefully we get rain out of these clouds because we certainly need it. Get some video of those yellow fields. Green and yellow, so much nicer than brown. And now we get a little downdraft. Westlock traffic, I'll play Fox Truck Tango up to Sierra Turning Final for a touch and go on the grass. And another little updraft. There! We're up about 1500, and that seems to have uh, smoothed out the air. The only problem is we're pretty much right where the clouds are. It's actually kind of cool. <laughs> and it is kind of cool. I think I'll give us some cabin heat here. I was going to take the fly baby up, but it's been in a while since I've flown. In fact, my last flight was in the fly baby. It's beautiful. Westlock traffic, I'll play Fox Shot Tango up here. Turning final for full stop. Shit, for it bar head already. Got Highway 18 down there. Couple of bugs on the windshield now. I got uh, these uh, gel seals for the headset. Man, oh man, what a what a difference they make! Like day and night. I can wear the headset for a couple of hours, no no uh, problem at all. to get some more video because who knows when I'm I doubt of all well depending on the weather but
That's good to see they get their hay done. Like they say, you gotta make hay or the sun shines. But man, that field is brown. There's Barhead right there. I was thinking about landing there, but no. I'd rather be in the sky today. Some of those crops look pretty thin in the lack of rain. It's been like 90, 100 degrees Fahrenheit. We've had days that were 36, 38 degrees Celsius. And that, that's hot. For us Canucks, anyway. Yeah, she's buried in cloud over there. on the uh, bar head. Make sure nobody's around. It's bar head. Home, James. I see that cloud there and damn near level with it. Beautiful morning, nope. I can take it. Kind of hoping I get get another long flight into Lacombe. I'm just going to put my other GoPro up there. Oh, hey, nice. Chris. Bit of a rudder dance there. Yeah, and do a time-lapse video. Kind of neat looking straight ahead though. The way the clouds are. Always squirrely air around the Pembina River for some reason. Kind of neat when you look at the river, the way it cut itself off, turns into these long strip lakes. in the fields where they they used to be used to run and then change course a lot of silt in that river right now lots of sandy beaches down there I'll do a thousand foot circuit. It gives me more time on my landing. Means I'm up here anyway. Time to bring her down a bit. Dropping 200 a minute. 
I think the battery will make it. Up for 35 minutes, so it'll be about a 40, 45 minute flight, I guess. Car is purdy. But we're getting socked in. An eye out for the other two, Dave and John. That cloud is like right there. At 3,500. Maybe I will go down to 500 feet. Yeah. With the sun shining through the windshield, I don't need the cabin heat. Good and low under those clouds now. Almost like they followed me down. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm thinking maybe I should drop down a little more. Way too close, sir. West Hawk Traffic, Ultralight, India, Sierra Charlie Hotel, both five miles west of the runway, inbound at uh, 3,200. I'll be dropping to uh, 2,800. West Hawk Traffic. Lots of hay bales. I hate having an engine out. Start playing duds at hay bale. That field is peppered with them. That's the worst part about this time of the year is pretty much going to have to take a road if something go wrong. Because the crops are going to end up upside down probably. The way this wind and air is, you'd have fun trying to guide yourself through those bales. Seventy-two mile, that's fast enough. I don't think any faster than that. Westlock traffic, I'll delete India, Sarah Charlie Hotel, long downwind per two eight. Westlock traffic. The thermals are carrying me back up. West Hawk Traffic, Ultralight India, Sierra Charlie Hotel, downwind for 2.8 at uh, 2,800 feet. West Hawk Traffic. West Hawk Traffic, Ultralight, India, Charlie, Charlie Hotel, left base, or right base 28. West Hawk Traffic. Holy shit, am I ever getting carried here?
Hit the wing two for. Boy, oh boy, she took a. I saw traffic alternate in the uh, Sarah Charlie Hotel, final for 2 8. I saw traffic. If I can get her back on 2 8. Well, I'm back. Got the airplane tucked away. Let's see. I just gotta go get some gas now. It's my damn battery crapped out in the GoPro. So hopefully. Caught the landing. Man, I was kind of pissed off. I sh something told me to change that battery be just before I get back. It was kind of close to the airport, so I didn't bother. But you can see you're getting getting sucked in pretty good there. Those other guys aren't back yet. Yeah, so yeah, that's it. Bill, you know, it was a decent morning. Kind of windy and gusty. The landing. Got a feeling it's. Uh, I didn't record it. Because of the fact that uh, I pretty much greased it in, I'm going to assume uh, I didn't catch it on the GoPro. <laughs> yeah, so that's it. 